Fish on, mate. Oh, nice. Ready, oh, decent mate. little ready there. Mate. Check that out. Day dogs on. Oh, it looks pretty decent. Similar size, mate. On the eBay spinner. Fish on, mate. Not too bad either. That's not bad at all, mate. I can't complain to that. Young Lee's Kitchen. We're out here on a camp, uh, halfway through at the moment, it's day two. Um, done a bit of fishing, caught ourselves some redfin. Um, got my buddy E-Dog here with us as well. Come around and say good day, mate. Come around. What's going on, mate? E-Dog from Dads and Lads. He's uh, got some winter squid. Some winter squid as well. Yeah. So E-Dog's got a channel as well, check him out. Dads and Lads Outdoors, does a lot of salt water stuff. Yep. Um, but today we're going to be cooking up a catch and cook fisherman's basket, pretty much. Let's go, I'm excited. Yeah, some prawns would have helped, mate. Or mate, some it would have been good, yeah. But let's go through everything you're going to need right now, guys. All right, I'll leave you to it. Cheers, mate. Do you want to do me a favour? Yeah. You just grab the cupy mayo out of me. Uh, French? Secret sauce, mate, that's the one. Secret sauce. The first thing you're going to need, some sort of dressing. Uh, tartare sauce was going to be a bit hard. Check out one of the other episodes, we'll show you how to make that. Uh, so we've gone with the secret sauce, Cupy Mayo. Next up, bag of chips. We've gone with pub style, extra crispy. Got some freshly filleted up red fin here. Three fishes, straight from the dam to the bag, ready for the pot. Some squid from E-Dog, already cleaned up. We're just gonna uh, score that one up into little pieces, uh, get some dustings on it. Cast iron pan to cook it all in. Some oil, we've gone with canola oil. You can use sunflower, olive oil, anything you want. This one's nice and cheap. And the way we're gonna cook up the uh, fish and squid today is we're gonna crumb it. So you're gonna need a little bit of flour, a couple of eggs, and some breadcrumbs. And we're gonna get a little bit fancy with ours. We're gonna put some Cajun seasoning in there. And for your chips, can't go wrong with the old chippy salt, mate. You like chippy salt? Mate, who doesn't like chippy salt? So, got the fish already filled it up, ready to crumb. We've just got to score up the squid now. Uh, so we might as well get that underway, and then we're going to get the cast iron pot on the flames, spit of oil in there, and get that up to temperature. Let's get it underway. So we've got the squid here, ready to go, a little inky. But we're just going to uh, score that up. Can't do this camera. So you just want to kind of do a bit of a, fuck, what's it called, cross hatch? Cool. So you just kind of, yeah, <laughs> what is that what it called? Yeah, criss cross. So you just want to kind of, so you just want to do a kind of criss cross sort of pattern, get it so it all fans out, and we're just going to cut it into nice little bite sized pieces. Right, squid's all prepped up, and the readies. We've got the skin off of them. Nice healthy fillets. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
Right, so before you get started, you want to get your breadcrumbs. You can sort of put lemon pepper in here, um, salt, pepper, you can keep it nice and plain, but we, like I said, we're going to go with Cajun. So I'm going to give that a good sprinkle. You like Cajun, eh? Mate, love Cajun. Let's go. Give that a bit of a mix through. And now we'll get them all crumbed up. So the way you want to do that to crumb them, straight into your flour. From the flour into your egg mix. And from your egg mix into your breadcrumbs. That's the fish all crumbed up. Uh, before I forget, we should probably put the cast iron pan on and get some oil in there, so let's get that on. All right, so that fire is, she's roaring. Not too bad at all. So we're gonna be deep frying, so you need plenty of oil for deep frying. Enough to cover the whole fish, the chips, the squid, the whole lot, so. Might even just bomb this whole thing in. Alright, so we'll let that heat right up. We're going to quickly dust off the squid, crumb them up, um, and we'll probably have to, it's not, not a very pan, so we'll probably cook up some chips first, then the fish, then the squid, plate it all up. Let's get the squid done. Same deal again. Squid in the flour, to the egg, to the breadcrumbs. This is a lot of food here, mate. May have gone overboard. All right, out of breadcrumbs. That's all the squid crumbed up. Bit of a mess. Um, we'll probably go check this pot of oil now. Do the test. Chuck a bit of flour in there. Make sure it's uh, sizzling. Get these uh, chips underway. Get some paper towel out. We'll, you'll see. Get some lemon cut up. It's going to be a good time. Uh, over to the pan. Alright, so the pot's nice and hot now. I'm gonna bomb in me pub style chips. Uh, probably don't need this whole lot, but we'll go two handfuls, I reckon. We'll give them a little stir about halfway through, make sure they're all fully coated in the oil. And that should probably take a couple minutes. Chips have been on for about five minutes. Got the camp stove top here, bit of paper towel. Just drain the oil off of them. I've only got the tongs, I haven't got one of them uh, little deep fryer scoop of things, but we'll make this work. them aside keep them warm and we're gonna bomb all the fish and the calamari in all at once give that about five minutes I reckon This is looking good, nice and golden brown. Can't really see because it's a bit shadowy, but that's what you want, nice and crispy. Pop that in with the chips, get the squid out, and that's lunch. There we go, guys. Good looking feed. 
We're gonna run some B-roll, check that out, and we'll give it a taste test. Mate. mate, that is us. Fish, fisherman's basket. Mate, go a beer. There's nothing like fish and chips in the beer. Cheers, bro. Cheers, mate. Thanks for cooking. Not bad for a Sunday afternoon. Oh, the crunch. Bit of chicken salt. Mate, everywhere. How easy is that? Just the, gonna catch it. The fishing it. was the hardest part. Yeah. No, we're doing pretty well. Yep. Chips, super crispy. Mm -hmm. Hear that crunch? Bit of squid. Squid, how's the squid? Good, mate. Some secret sauce. Mmm. I reckon. Gotta open it. Boom, you fucking stump. A bit of squid. We're coming up, I'll show you. Squid. Real nice and crispy. The chips. Hear that crunch? Yeah, the crunch. Crunch. <laughs> crunch. And some the fish. Go some of that, mate. Isn't that a tasty looking filly there? Let's get some secret sauce on, give it all a go, mm. mate. How's that squid? Man, lovely. You've done well, mate, catch and cook. Mm -hmm. Bit of salt, bit of fresh water. It's all coming together nicely. Mm. Happy with that? Done. Beautiful. There you go, guys. Dam and salt water mix, fisherman's basket, few chips, bit of fish, bit of squid. Um, not bad for a Sunday luncheon, so if you like this sort of thing, you got anything out of it, consider giving us a like and a subscribe. To all the uh, regular fans, thanks for watching as always, appreciate it. Check out uh, E-Dog's channel, Dads and Lads, I'll put a little link down here I reckon, a little link there. Um, merch, Bushrats are a big cartel, but we will see you next time out on the tracks. Cheers bro. Stay in.